and I'm going to show you how to turn your pictures into a video using Animoto. First, you'll open your web browser and go to animoto.com. Then you will click sign in if you already have an account or sign up to create an account. And then over in the right hand corner, you'll want to click on the create video button. This takes you to the pick a video style page where you'll choose your background for your video. You can scroll down to view all the choices and you can only choose the ones with the red dot if you have a pro account. So today we're going to choose the color fold background by clicking on create. This takes us to the page where we upload our pictures. We can upload from our computer. We can retrieve pictures from Facebook or another website, or you can select from Animoto's collection. Today, we're gonna to upload from our computer, so I click Upload. And here, I'm gonna upload pictures of book covers. So I click on the first one I want to use. I hold down my Shift key and click on the last one I want to use. And this highlights all the consecutive photos in between. And then I click on Open. And Animoto uploads the pictures to their website. Down across the bottom of this window is a small taskbar that allows us to work with our pictures. We can add more pictures by clicking here and uploading more pictures. You can add text by clicking on a picture and then clicking the Add Text button. This inserts a box in between your photos and opens up a dialog box on the right where you can type in your text. You can also add subtext, which will be a little bit smaller than your main text. And then you can drag that box wherever you would like it. You can add as many text boxes as you would like. We'll just add one more. And you can also drag and drop the pictures to any order you would like. You can also spotlight a photo by clicking on the spotlight button at the bottom. This allows this picture to stay on the screen a little bit longer than your other pictures. You can deselect it by clicking the spotlight button again. You can also rotate pictures, duplicate your pictures, or delete any that you do not want in your video. If it does not matter what order your picture's in, you may choose the shuffle button. When you're done, you click the done button. And here you choose your music that you would like to play during your video. You can upload any music that you have on your computer or you can select from Animoto's collection, which we'll do today. So we click Select, and there are several different categories to choose from. Then you choose one of the categories by clicking on it. You can listen to any of the selections by clicking on the blue play button. To choose one of the songs to play, that you would like to play, you click the green Select button. This inserts the music to be played during your video. If you would like to change it, you click change your soundtrack here and it will take you back and allow you to choose another song. Once you've made this selection, click the continue button. Here you're allowed to customize your video. You choose your image pacing by choosing half speed, regular speed, or twice the speed. This determines how long each picture shows on the screen. You can choose short or full length for your video length. This is the video style that we chose at the beginning. You can change it now by clicking here or you can leave it as what you originally chose. Once you've made this selections, we'll click continue. And this is the page where we add our title for our video.
you can add a short description. And Animoto automatically puts the sign-up name as the producer name here. In the upper right-hand corner here, you can choose which picture you would like to be the thumbnail for your video. You can choose any one of the pictures you're uploaded. We're going to leave the one that we originally started with. Once we're done, we click Create Video. And Animoto begins producing your video. You will receive an email once your video is completed, and you can use that link to come back, or you can just leave this page up and come back to it, and it will look like this when the video is ready. You can choose to play your video here. If you decide you'd like to redo it, you go down to Tools, and you can choose Remix, and it will reprocess your video. You can also choose to share your video on Facebook, on Twitter, on YouTube, and you can also email the link to anyone that you choose. You can choose the Embed button to get the embed code to put this video on a website or you can download the video directly to your computer. I hope that you have found this tutorial useful. We have covered choosing a background, uploading and arranging your pictures, choosing the music, and naming and creating your video. However you choose to share your video, I hope that you enjoy using Animoto.